Minister Daryl, would you come, please? Followed by Minister in Training Arlanda. Amen, truth and love. Amen. I won't complain. <laughs> because I know today that the battle is not mine. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> and that brings me peace and joy. Because yeah. I don't have to worry about nothing. Yeah. In the book of James, chapter 1, it says, mm -hmm. My brethren, count it all joy Come on. when you fall into diverse yeah. temptations, knowing this, yeah. that the trying of your faith worketh patience. Yes. 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 Now, once that patience has been worked, that's where you get your peace and joy. <laughs> so let God work that patience in your life. You know, this past year, as I reflect on this past year, four to five months out of this year, I was in the hospital going through all kind of physical trials and tribulations. Blood infections, food, pneumonia, you name it, I had it, but I didn't have COVID. <laughs> <laughs> Took everything else but that. But you know what? Even through that, I realized today that the battle wasn't mine, even going through those physical transformations in my life. It was all about the Lord. Come on. And if you know, every time I get an opportunity to preach the word of God, I always talk about love. Yeah. And how we have to love others like Christ loved us. And that's an individual thing because when you experience the love of God for yourself, yes. for your personal life, for the trials and tribulations that you've experienced, the deaths, mm. the depressions, the fears, all of those things. When you experience those things and God loved you through all of that, it makes it so much easier to love everybody else. Amen. We have a very special loving church here. Amen. Truth and love is a loving church. I mean, prayers are heard, prayers are felt. They've helped me in financial situations, or not they, but this church, the love of this church. Amen. I won't complain. And the battle is not mine. It all belongs to the Lord. So my prayers today is to just let God have his way. And those trials and tribulations that you experience, not just through your life, but on a daily basis. Wow. Just realize that it's not your battle. Mm -hmm. It's the Lord's. Mm -hmm. And let the Lord love you. And you realize how the Lord loves you. So you can love others as yeah. he's loved you. Yeah. 